I have the blue ESR tester from Anatech Instruments and this is used to check the ESR or equivalent series resistance of capacitors and this puts out a very tiny voltage so you can check the capacitors in circuit. It's a little easier to read the numbers when it's tilted upward so I have this stand made specifically for this blue ESR tester and it just fits right in there holds it at a nice angle and when you're not using the tester it has a spot in the back to store the leads to use the ESR tester push the button on top once to turn it on and then connect the leads together and this will show you the resistance in the leads and the wires and push the button a second time to zero it out I have the logic board out of a computer monitor that isn't working and usually that's because of bad capacitors so I'm going to check these I'll start with this one here so I'll just flip the board over and I will use the ESR meter and connect them to the leads on the capacitor and see what the resistance is and that capacitor is right over here so just touch these leads onto there and we're getting about a 0.36 ohms for that capacitor this is a chart that's provided with the ESR meter and that capacitor is 25 volts and 100 microfarads so if we just go down the column here you can see it should be a maximum ohms of 0 0.5 and it was 0.36 so it is under the limit so that one is good next I'm going to check this one over here it's the same size 25 volt 100 microfarad and that one is right here and you can see I'm getting about 4.0 ohms on that and that is well above the 0 0.5 max so that capacitor is bad and I will replace that one so this ESR tester is very useful for checking for bad capacitors in circuit